video and today i'm going to be showing you how to obtain true verse to load in reaper 2 but before we get started if you're new please drop us up let's say to 2.5k sub for the end of october and drop a like on the video leave a comment down below and yeah let's get straight to it all right so i just want to say i guess my voice sounds weird i'm a little sick right now so bear with it please but yeah the first thing you're gonna do is come here and talk to ichigo at spawn and basically what it says is crack i know you guys are wondering how do i crack my mask i'm gonna show you just come through here to heko mundo now once you're in heko mundo you basically just wanna come down here and aggro i think like these two should be fine two minus grandia yeah. and basically your mask cracks when you get into the zero it has a chance to happen it won't happen guaranteed but yeah that's how you crack your mask you just get hit with the zero and you chill so once you've accrued them both you just want to get teleported up and chill there until your mask breaks and of course if, it, if it's taking a long time you can just aggro the rest but if you have time it's better to just get two because you might die like I did trying to aggro all four. So once that's done you just sit here and wait until your mask breaks. And as you can see my mask finally cracked. So now we can get into step two of the quest. Hello young one, I see you've cracked your mask. Would you like to complete my quest in order to evolve? Yes. And there he gave us the quest. And now I'm going to show you the best method to complete it. So I usually like starting with the hardest one. So as you can see the first one is to kill five guardians. And you can find these guardians in hell. If you don't know how to get there you just come in here. Go through, click on the gate. So now this is what a guardian looks like right here that's a guardian and basically the best method to kill them is i mean obviously you want to do your damage and stuff and you just want to wait for him to use like a, an area move you'll know when he uses it because to bring like a, a danger zone on the floor yeah like that then you want to use deceit which is your counter to avoid all that damage because if you don't you'll take like 600 damage but that's smash see just time it See, I didn't counter it in time and I took a, a chunk of damage. But yeah, that's how you kill them. And I'm just gonna finish this up real quick. Now once you're done with killing the guardians, you come down here and then you're gonna start killing these NPCs called blanks. You need to kill three of them so like just line them up like this easy next we're gonna move on to kill three vasto loaders if, if they can stop lagging so for these things basically just just go crazy use your counter use your grab use everything can't do anything about it Use your zero. Now, once you've killed all the Vasto Lodes, you wanna get out of this dimension, go back to the main world, and once you're out, now you wanna come and kill some Ajuka. So you just find the way up here. the Aju because you need to kill three. And 
now once you're done killing the juke you wanna come back down here to the menus cave and kill both hollows and menus because as you know when you're fighting the menus they end up spawning hollows so this is the first way to get the quest done you can you wanna time it so that you do your grab but the menus is gonna use its serve so that you end up not taking any damage and finally I'm on my last menus boom there we go clean clean and yeah just like that was a true verse to load in and it looks like I rolled horrible so now for the horrible showcase here we go your right click is actually like a, a ranged attack shoot out like a water cannon so it's not the usual guard break which might make it harder to start combos but obviously 64 m1 damage should uh i don't think you need a crit if you do 64 m1 damage but yeah here are the skills um here's the z damn kind of missed it here's the x yeah like a little crazy combo extender And of course you can use sword skills with this, you can do. Like this, like, like this thing is low-key strong as hell man. Watch it. And that's the C move. Crazy eh? And your, your flash steps are alright. Not too fast. And now I'm going to try to spin for Ichigo's true verse to load a form and give you a showcase. Alright, so one thing about this is that the flash step is crazy, bro. I, let, me, let me just read it from here. I'm going to tap it the second I, I reach that. And also a good thing about this is that you can use melee instead of just sword. But now for the skills. Um, I hope I don't one shot them, but here's the X uncharged. You can hold it to do more damage. Yet it, it did 18, but tick. Thirty-seven, I hit, man. That is crazy. And then next now for the Z skill. Are you seeing how much damage that did, bro? It completely 100 to 0 that NPC. And you do 48 damage per M1. Oh, so it's like a knockback move. It's not a combo extender. And yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope that now you guys know how to obtain true astrology like the video drop us up and i'll see you all in the next one peace